Well, hello, hello. Welcome back, welcome back to my YouTube channel, man. Shout out to everybody who's been watching my videos, man. Welcome back to Lucky Lifestyle. This is my YouTube channel. I am your host with the most give a toast. Nah, I'm just bullshit. But yeah, um, welcome back, man. This is Fit Vlog episode number four. So, um, yeah, man, today we got something special for y'all. We're actually gonna do something a little bit different. Um, I'm actually not gonna be working out in the gym today. Today we're gonna be doing some green exercise. Uh, basically, in the training world, that terminology just means we're gonna be doing some uh, working out outside, basically. So, um, it's very beneficial to just get outside sometimes, man, and absorb sunlight. I know a lot of us, we spend a lot of time indoors, whether we just work in uh, our jobs or just spending time at the house, man. We got to get outside more, get off our cell phones, get back reconnected. So, I'm going to utilize today's workout to kind of do that. Get some vitamin D, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my melanated people, bro. We need to get more sunlight. We are electromagnetic beings, so we need to get more connected to nature and get more connected to the sun. And, uh, you know, the divinity that that resides within each of us. Um, so, again, shout out to everybody who's been watching my channel, man. I've been getting people coming up to me at my job at Crunch Fitness Cameron Village, you know what I'm saying? The best gym in Raleigh, you know what I mean? We got the best members, we got the best staff. We just, it's just a great environment. I've been learning so much since I came in and just made, met so many amazing people. And uh, as you see, uh, cause I've been doing some collabs with some of them. Um, today's collaboration is with my, my guy. I also work with him. He is a PT, personal trainer. Um, just a cool guy, man, solid dude. We chop it up a lot, man. We have a lot of conversations and he has a, he has a great mindset. So I feel like um, today y'all gonna get a good vibe, get a good energy and back and forth between me and him while we also work out as well. And uh, yeah, man, I feel like he got something to offer y'all. So that's why I'm collaborating with him, you know. I'm very, very specific, very particular about the people who I do my content with because with this right here, you know, whatever I, whatever I create, I'm pretty anal about. You know what I'm saying? And I just like to make sure that whatever I do, I'm doing it to the best of my ability and I'm giving y'all something. And I'm bringing along people as well that can give y'all something too, man, because it's not just about me. As much as I say that at this channel, bro, this this stuff that, that I create is not about me. It's about the viewers, man. It's about y'all, the people that tune in every time. You know what I'm saying? When I see those views going up, you know, every single day, you know what I mean? On my fitness vlogs and people tuning in and people telling me and giving me positive feedback, man. It's, it's you guys. You are the reason why I continue to create this content. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, it's not for me. A lot of this stuff that I do, like I'm aware of, of fitness and health and all of this stuff. But I enjoy creating it and I enjoy giving something out to the universe. You know what I'm saying? So, um, which brings me to another point, man. Whatever it is that you guys have any type of interest in, man, even if you have never explored it before, you never know where those interests can take you. So don't learn to not really focus on other people's opinion because a lot of times that people that do, they don't do something, it's because how they feel like somebody else is going to view them. You know what I'm saying? Like, just like right now, how I'm recording myself. I have to understand that, you know, sometimes I might I might put something out, somebody might not agree with it, but that's not really the whole purpose of why I'm doing what I'm doing. It's because of I got something to share that's valuable. And I'm going to continue to put it out. So you kind of got to get over that fear and that self-doubt and just have confidence, 100% confidence in whatever it is that you're doing. It doesn't matter if you're trying to be a culinary artist. It doesn't matter if you're, just try if you're trying to be a rap artist, if you're trying to be a uh, go professional with basketball. You know what I'm saying? Or if you're trying to be a pro gamer and just get paid to clap people on Apex, man. Just do whatever it is. Just do it with confidence, man. Because only you determine how far you go in this life. And for me, I'm going to take this and everything else that I do in my life with my ambitions. I'm going to take it to the furthest extent that I can take it. I'm not really worried about what people think, bro. So, yeah. If I did, would I wear, would I wear these, bro? Would I wear these? I remember I used to hate on Crocs, bro. I ain't going to lie. Shout out to my boy Miles because he blessed me, though. But these joints are so comfortable, bro. Mm. If, I, if I wasn't, you know, weird, I would probably sleep in them. But, like... If I care what people think, I wouldn't wear these. I definitely wouldn't have got this color. Cause you gonna see this. This don't never match nothing I got going on, bro. But I wear this because this is what I like. This is what I feel like doing. And I don't give up what people think. So yeah, you just gotta get over that, man. You know what I'm saying? But enough of that. 
Um, I'm about to holler at my boy, man. I got to meet up with him in like um, an hour or so. So I'm going to get me a little pre-workout meal in, nothing too heavy. Probably a piece of fruit and uh, give me a, a small dose of like some complex carbs. Just keep me satiated while I work out. Plus, during this time for me, just for me specifically, my body's not really cool with me eating. And I try to just stay in tune with my body. If, I, if it says it's not, you know, it, it doesn't want to take on any food at this time, then I listen to it, you know, and then a couple hours from now, I'll get hungry. So I've been doing a lot of fasting uh, workouts lately. Well, semi-fasted. I have like a small, like I said, a small pre-workout meal consisted of a piece of fruit and then like some complex carbs to just kind of sustain me, give me some energy during my workout. And then I have my first meal with my protein, etc. after that. So that's what I'm going to get into right now, man. Um, thank you guys for tuning in again, man. And uh, I'll see y'all in a second, man. Yo. Yo. Oh, y'all thought y'all weren't going to see the headband, bro? Come on now. You know I'm Hokage, bro. Y'all gonna see this headband every time I shoot a video, bro. Every single time I shoot a video on my channel, y'all gonna see it, bro. But um, it's Friday right now. Um, just left the house. We on the way to meet my my homie E-Man real quick so we can get this workout in. I'm actually looking forward to it, man. I don't work out outside as much as I'd like to, to be honest with you. Um, and like I said, man, meeting a lot of people at this gym and just people I've been collaborating with, they've been kind of putting me on a lot of different stuff, folks. So, it's always good to switch up your regimen a little bit, man. Things get so stagnant, you're doing PPLs all the time or you're doing the same muscle groups, the same exercises, the same, same type of training. So it's always good to switch it up and then you can kind of come back to what you know too as well and just incorporate everything together and just, you know, build better programs for yourself. But always just train for whatever your goals are, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you're training for aesthetic, train for aesthetic. If you're training to be a, a power lifter, you know what I'm saying? You're probably gonna stick to like one to five rep maxes. You know, stuff like that, but yeah. I'm looking forward to getting this sunlight on my skin, man. I'ma probably be a little bit darker by the end of this video. <laughs> we'll, we'll see what happens, but I'm looking forward to it though, man. It's good to get back into the, into nature and just kind of connect, you know what I'm saying? Um, I think that's what we, we're missing out on a lot right now with, uh, you know, Instagram and all of the social networking and all of that stuff. But it's funny because we actually utilize those things a lot to connect with others. And then when we be in social settings, we actually be on our phones instead of actually talking to the people around us. So it's an interesting concept, man. But uh, I'll see y'all soon, bro. We're gonna get this workout in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna introduce, introduce you to my boy, get a little bit of background information from him so y'all can kind of get a feel of who he is as a person. But like I said, man, he's solid. He's a good dude. So. And he got that good energy, man. So y'all gonna see all that in a minute. But uh, yeah, I'll see y'all in a minute, bro. Peace. I'll see y'all in a minute, though. Yo. I'm here with my man E, you know what I'm saying? My oh, man, it's good with you. You feel me? We out here, about to get it in. So, I'm just talk to him real quick about how his fitness journey and how he got started, basically, man. So, you know what I'm saying? Talk to the people. For let sure, them know. Sure. Let them know how you got started, you know what I'm saying? What's going on, everybody? Like you said before, my name is E. Hey, so it's been a while, man. It's, it's been a long time coming. Uh, from Wilmington, North Carolina. Shout out to 910. Nice. Uh, growing up, man, played football all my life. And uh, so I, I always enjoyed the physical aspect of things and, and working hard, you know, going through the struggle to, you know, get to that place where you're playing in the game. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, I always enjoyed uh, the process of things. So nice. that's yeah. how I got started. Uh, when I was like 10 years old, my dad brought me some weights in the backyard. I used to lift in the sun. Uh, didn't know what a gym was. That's why he's so <laughs> swole now, because he started at <laughs> 10 years old. That's why, right didn't there. Didn't know what a gym was, man. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. Uh, so I was working out outside. I would fill up water jugs and, mm -hmm. and do jumping jacks, you know, crazy stuff. You know, people, things that people never seen before. Yeah. And so from there, I knew I developed, uh, you know, a passion for fitness. You mm -hmm. know? And that's how I got started. Okay, and cool, I just man. took off ever since. Got my education and went that route. So now he now he out here looking like a GI Joe, bro. You feel me? <laughs> y'all gonna, <laughs> gonna see later, bro. He humble, but my man, he out here, bro. He, he swole, bro. He jacked. We do it, man. Bro. So what what uh what is your favorite exercise actually? Cause I know my man, he like he be putting me on stuff I ain't never seen before. So when he say he be doing stuff nobody ever thought of, he be on, bro. So if you want to switch up your routine, come holler at him. 
he gonna hook you up. Sure. But what's your favorite exercise to hit, man? Like what you like to do most? You talking outside or inside? Outside or inside. You could do one or both. Inside, I'll say curls. Something about curls, man. It like just, bicep curls? Bicep curls all okay, day. Nice, yeah. Something about it, it just, it's, you can stack the weight. Mm -hmm. uh, you can do different uh, exercises. You can go halfway, you can go all the way. You can do 21s. Mm -hmm. Love it, man. Preacher curl, concentrated. Bicep is my favorite. Outside, yeah. I was have to say pull ups. And you're going to see some of that today. Yeah. So, we, we definitely so that's my favorite. That yeah. yeah. So, you basically like the back, you like the back. Is that your favorite muscle group, with the, or is the bicep your favorite muscle group? Strangely, I know I said uh, bicep curls. Mm -hmm. I know I said pull-ups, but I love working the back. Okay, yeah. Yeah, That's, my back, yeah. Is, back is the favorite, for sure. I can tell. Because <laughs> it's just, I ain't going to say nothing else. I'm going to just let y'all peep my man, though. But we about to get into this workout, man. Shout out to my man, Eve, you know what I'm saying, devote some time and energy to, sure. you know, to add something to the channel, man. But I told y'all, like, I, I pick specific people for specific reasons, you know what I'm saying? Like, my man's got a good energy, he know his stuff, and like he said, man, he's he's very inspiring, you know what I'm saying? Inspired to, you know, and he likes the process, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? That's what keeps people working out, that's what keeps people in the gym, that's what keeps people fit. And that's why he been doing it so long, from from 10 years old when he got his first weights, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Training in the sun, filling up his, up his water jug, you know what I'm saying? Probably drinking out the hose, everybody did that. Yes, sir. When you pinch it, you know what I'm saying? You give it to your homeboy, you know? <laughs> Back in the day, you know what I'm saying? But sure. we're gonna get this workout in, man. I'll show y'all what we got going on today, man. Let's do Stay it. Stay tuned. Getting hot. It is getting it's hot. It's getting hot. That boy <laughs> back, boy. Your back is, is the same, bro. There you go. Let's get it. I ain't trying to say you don't need to go to the gym, but you don't need the gym for all this right here. You get cut, it's all you need. There you go. It's all you need. When your DMs blow up, bro, I'm just I'm just saying, you don't owe me nothing. Just be like, yep, you was right. I just want you was right. Yes, sir. My head get big, get some of the sun. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Get swole with no no gym equipment, bro. Not at all. You know, switching up that regimen a little bit, man. Shout out to Edo. Introduce me to this area. You know what I'm saying? Good out here. So I'm definitely gonna be adding, adding this to my regimen for sure. Shout out to my boy though. Before I go to feeling? sleep. How you feeling? My man. Before I go to that's sleep, how, you gotta kiss the muscle. That's how you making them bitches grow, huh? Uh-huh. Yeah. Tell her you better grow. We out here. <laughs> we out here.
Stay hydrated, man. My sticker go hard, don't it? Shout out to all the girls with the little shorts on, you know what I'm saying? Big facts. <laughs> That shit different. Oh, oh fuck. God damn. <laughs> Come on, look. That's the that's the Naruto run right there. All my weaves, y'all know y'all know what's up with me. I kid you not. If you do this more often, like you train out, you train outside, outdoors. Do calisthenics, you do like a whole bunch of running. Gym is great, but the gym is not gonna feel as good as this. It's like when I go to the gym, it's great, it's wonderful, but something about this, something about this, I can't explain. What's your favorite thing about working out outside, bro? Well, the benefits, uh, if you, you know, do your research and whatnot, the benefits of working out underneath the sun. Also, it just, I feel like it really gives you the overall, what you call fit body. You know, some guys go to the gym, they get the quick pump, you know, as they say, pump cover, you know, and, and they, they get their pump and they sit down, they chill, they eat heavy and just sit, you know? This right here, this is working your whole physique, day in, day out. Keep and it moving, bro, right? Keep it moving. I'm trying to tell you, just like uh, athletes, same thing. The way they train, the way athletes train is the same thing. Can't make it up. That shit rough, bro. But we out here though. We out here. We out here though. <sighs> that boy's swole, bro. How much you weigh? <laughs> Probably near. Most guys think I'm like 190. Yeah. Near 200. No. No. I'm like in the 70s. 170 something? Probably almost touching 180. Damn. Yeah, not much, man. I'm lean. 
Yeah, that's uh, what it is. You got the good amount of muscle, and then it's just leaned out too, man. So that's right. You just solid, bro. Never like what you call dirty boat. Yeah. I like the clean boat. I'm only like seven. Like seven percent body fat. Word? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, oh, shit, I see it, bro. They see it too. Don't be blowing my man DMs after y'all see this video. You don't tell me what you what y'all do what y'all doing. I'm watching. <laughs> <laughs> that wraps up fifth vlog episode five, man. Shout out to my boy E, man, for coming through. Shout out to Luck, man. Appreciate you, know? you having me. Bro. Yeah, man, most definitely, bro. You mm. already getting it out here. You know what I'm saying? Getting that calisthenic workout. Mm -hmm. Training, training like an athlete. You know what I'm saying? Do some tire flips. Thanks. Got them pull ups. Got that good work in. You know what I'm saying? So stay tuned. Look out for my man, bro. He doing his thing. Right. He a good PT too. So if y'all in the uh, Crunch Cameron Village, Raleigh area, come look him up. Y'all need some PT training? Come holla at my man. Come to the club. Come see me. Come see my boy. You got uh, you got anything for the people, man? Yeah, Any man. words of inspiration? Look, y'all. Stay encouraged and stay working. Stay grinding, man. You know, it may not look like it right now, but later down the road, you will see changes. You just, just got to stay consistent. You got to keep your your focus, you gotta keep the goal in front of your mind and go after that and surround yourself with like-minded people. Just just like Luck, you know, Luck called me, he said, you wanna shoot this video? I said, bet. So he said, had it been somebody else, I don't know. But like-minded people, when great comes, when great meets great, mm -hmm. what do you expect? It's gonna have good things, you bro, you know? That's right. And again, shout out to uh, everybody that's been subscribing, you know what I'm saying? Checking out my channel and everything, bro. I'm gonna that's keep right. blessing y'all with more content. I'm gonna keep, putting another spin on, you know what I'm saying, this health and fitness thing that we doing out here, giving y'all some new, unique people, you know what I'm saying, like my man here, showing y'all some stuff. You know what I'm saying, get outside, man, especially my melanated people, bro. Get that sun on that skin, bro. You know what I'm saying, charge your body up, get more connected with nature, get more connected with the divinity that's in all of us, you feel me? So, you know what I'm saying, but yo, it's been a great time, man. Shout out to my boy E again. Y'all stay tuned, man. Lucky lifestyle. Stay tuned, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, comment, subscribe, and follow my man on IG. You can follow me on IG as well, man. I'll put the links, you know what I'm saying, right here for y'all. All, All right. right. Peace.